Okay, we picking up a bus from the IC bus plant in Tulsa. I just got off of uh, 169 in Tulsa onto Pine Street. I'm headed west. Several ways you can come in to it. This is the way I come into it in January. Um, okay, this is Pine. We're going to come down right down here to this intersection of Pine and Mingo. There's a quick trip there. That is where you will get fuel at because most of these buses are sitting on red when you pick them up. I was told they have approximately two to three gallons of fuel in them when they're at the bus plant. So you're not going to go far without stopping and most everybody stops this quick trip right up here on the right. So this is Pine. We're coming up to Mingo. Now, if you're coming from the airport, you're going to be coming from that direction over there straight. But then if you're coming from the airport, you don't probably have a tow car. So that's the quick trip. That's where everybody gets fuel. Looks like it's $4.95 for diesel. Ugh. Good thing I got mud flap. I can get it about 30 cents cheaper, about 50 miles up the road. So I will come down, I will put a couple dollars of uh, maybe 10, 15, maybe 20, maybe 20 bucks of fuel in my uh, bus so I can make it up to the next fuel stop. trailer here with truck mover sign on it. It's the second left. Once you come go under the unpass, you're gonna come in here. If you got a tow car, you're gonna go to the right. If you don't, you're gonna go to this trailer on the. Uh, and here's a bunch of non-tow car drivers standing there out in a way. So. Um, this is the, where you park your tow car. Okay. Couple, three, four spots here. Uh, then you will take you down. Uh, well, let me bring you back. Um, I gotta grab my paperwork and I'll show you what to do next. Okay, if you're having someone bring you in, do not park at that trailer. They don't like that. Park over here someplace. Walk over through that gate to that second door in the trailer. I suppose there's only, no, there's two doors. Not the first one, second. Take your BOL in and they there is an aero photo of this place and they will tell you which lot your bus is in. They will give you a inspection sheet, truck movers inspection sheet. You fill it out. Once you do your pre-trip, you'll pull up here, like a lot of these people, you'll honk. They will come out, inspect your paperwork and everything. Okay, you're good to go. And that's basically how you pick a bus up here at IC Bus Plant in Tulsa. So. Pretty simple, really nice people here. There goes, get you out of here with your bus. 
And so anyway, that's how we do it. Now, once you get your paperwork, okay, once they give you your paperwork, you can come out here and start looking at your unit number for your bus, you'll find it, start it. Like I say, pull back up here. If you're in this lot, you'll pull back up here, honk, and they will come out, check everything, get you on your way. So that's how you pick a bus, bus at the bus plant in Tulsa. Okay, I gotta get off here and find my bus. Thank y'all for watching. Like and subscribe. Okay, here's this bus I'm delivering. A standard pretty much CDL bus. No CDL buses and non CDL. This one weighs about 29,000 or GVWR 29,000 on it. So, anyway, yep, they're easy 65 gallon. Yep. Gotta go in here and do the little boy thing this morning. <laughs> 